Hello and welcome. In this video lesson, you will learn about the object's properties within CATIA v5. So let's get started. All objects in CATIA have a set of properties that control how they update and display, as well as other settings. You can access an object's properties by selecting properties from the specification tree pop-up menu, or by picking an object and selecting edit properties. The dialog contains various tabs, which display depending on which combination of objects you select. The mechanical tab controls the update status of the selected object. Deactivated allows you to mark the features temporarily removed from the model. To update indicates that the selected feature is out of date and needs to be updated. Unresolved indicates whether there is an update problem with the feature. Stop update allows you to set a breakpoint so that CATIA stops an update at a particular feature. The Feature Properties tab displays information about object creation and modification. You can enter a new name in the text box. This name displays in the specification tree, making it easier to find things in a large model. The Graphic tab in the Properties dialog controls how features and other geometry display. In the Fill Group box, the Color and Transparency settings apply to solid and sheet bodies, as well as features. These options apply in the Shaded and Wireframe display modes. Edges allows you to control the color, line type, and thickness for the emphasized edges of entire bodies. These options apply in the Shading with Edges display mode. Lines and Curves allows you to apply settings to curve and sketch geometry, as well as reference features. When a point is selected, Points allows you to change the color and the point symbol. The shown checkbox under Global Properties indicates whether an object is visible or not. This setting is changed by selecting View, Hide Show, Hide Show, or simply right-click and select Hide Show. The Pickable checkbox indicates that an object is available for selection. Deactivate this option to make an object visible but unavailable for selection. The Low Intensity checkbox allows you to apply color to low intensity objects, such as parts, products, and drawings. The Rendering Style dropbox allows you to make the style of a particular object different from the global setting. For example, you can show one face in wireframe while the rest of the part is shaded. This setting is used when Rendering Style per object is active in the Custom View Modes dialog. Select View, Toolbars, Graphic Properties to display the Graphic Properties toolbar. The settings on the toolbar work the same way as those in the Properties dialog and control whatever object is currently selected. The layer list also shows the active layer on which any new objects are created. Painter allows you to transfer display properties from one object to another. To use the option, Click the icon, pick the object you want to change, and then pick the object with the properties you want to use. 
Graphic Properties Wizard allows you to see the hierarchy of the graphic properties of a particular object. Congratulations! You have just completed the CATIA Get Started course. Now you are ready to move forward to the next course, which is the sketching in CATIA V5. In this course, you will be introduced to CATIA V5 Sketcher Workbench. In addition to learning about reference features and geometry creation, you will also learn about sketch operations, constraints, and dimensions. Thanks for watching, and see you soon.